how you feel things are going for this group at this point of the offseason? Uh, especially the last couple of days, really good. Um, you know, we got through the first two days of helmets. We've been in that all summer. I think they were kind of bored with it. We got to put some shoulder pads on yesterday and get some hitting drills and, and, and throw it a little bit. And uh, when we got in group and team, things went uh, probably better than expected, you know, being our first real time with some shoulder pads on since camp in the summertime. So uh, really happy how yesterday went and looking forward to how we can uh, get back into it today because I know they're a little bit sore from yesterday. How much has this group kind of embraced, you know, now second year in 6A? You've got some experience back that kind of went through his battles last year. Uh, it's really the same thing. We were talking about with a couple of them yesterday just because it got brought up and just sitting around conversation on a water break. And even those two said they didn't have – it wasn't a problem for them last year. They enjoyed playing it. They didn't care. I, I think these guys kind of got the point that – as a coaching staff, we don't spend time on it at all. It's whoever the opponent is that week. We, we respect everybody we play. We know we're going to have to bring our A game if it's 5A or 6A, so they don't care. They just want to play football. How are you feeling about the offense at this point? Uh, it's grown since June. Um, we're starting to figure out um, kind of where their wheelhouse is as a group and what guys can do individually in their roles and stuff like that. So um, it's starting to gravitate where you know we, we kind of know what we are good at and trying to build on that and go from there and get a little bit more expansive with what's on, what's in the playbook for that part. What's impressed you the most about the defense at this point? Oh, uh, We're getting a lot. Our linebackers, we already expected. We felt like we're going to be a strong point of our defense this year. Uh, but not saying they're exceeding, but they are doing a lot better with their keys and getting where they need to be. And when they're not, they're able to break down and evaluate why they're not and tell us rather than us having to, we can ask, hey, you know what you did wrong? Yeah, tell me. And they just give it right back to you. And it's, not, it's that part of it with having some older guys back there makes a big difference. What are some of the other things you want to accomplish before the benefit game? Uh, we got to make sure we got to keep ramping up the physical part of it because we haven't been able to be hitting since really since spring ball. We had a few camps, but you really want to make sure your physical come week zero before uh, the first game. Uh, and then we got to make sure our cardio's up so we can fly to the ball defensively. Our philosophy is our, our best dudes always got to play defense. So we want to, as much as we can, keep that rotation to a minimum. We know defensive line's going to have to rotate quite a bit more than other spots, but uh, those guys got to be in shape and ready to play.